Hey Kia, what's up? It is Sydney, and we about to do a story time. Get ready with me, period. I was about to do a whole different kind of look, as you probably can see, but it was ugly, so we about to try again, period. Pink lemonade with the bomb, babe. Make the booty up, oh, like Beyonce. I can make the dick dance, rock it like a blast, and you want another chance, but I know we won't last, and your last bitch mad, because I'm coming up fast. I'm passing bitches up like they're running out of gas. Okay, so... I don't know why, but I just tried to do this bright makeup look, and it wasn't giving me nothing but homelessness and no clue what I was doing, those type of vibes. So, I'm going to be doing that orange all over lid look that you guys always be asking how I did it and everything. And what did I use and all that jazz. So that's what I'm about to be doing. But I really wanted to use my new pigments that I got from MYO Makeup. They have like these just pure pigments or whatever. And I really wanted to do it with like this blue. But with the same concept just all over the lid. Thick wing liner, lash, period. So that's what we gonna do today. I just made my mind up. We still gonna do the blue. But I tried to do like, just a few minutes ago, like a, honey, I don't know what to call it, to be completely honest. I don't know. But I'm not going to use any, um, I'm not gonna use any like primer or anything. I'm just gonna use the same, warm sand all over my eyes that I'll use on my eyebrows and then that's what we're gonna use to base it because I don't know I just didn't like the way it was looking because y'all know I'm like pretty basic with my makeup same makeup routine like that's what I like to do that's what I'm used to you know what I mean that's just how I am but I was trying to switch it up for y'all but we gonna try that on a later date Cause now is not the time for that. Apparently. Cause the way that looked a mess. It just we not doing that right now. So yeah, that's what I'm finna do. And the story I'm finna tell y'all is about my very first <laughs> sugar daddy situation ever in life. And it's really a funny ass story, like, because it just was so weird. So period, let's chat. So, I left my, um, I left my coconut oil for my lips. But anyway, so period. I was going to college and of course when I was in college, all we did was turn up, turn up, turn up, period. And, um, so I'm going to take this flat brush to push the product into my lid i really want to hold my head up because i already got some fallout on my shirt and i'm not really fucking with it and i got white on so if you can see it like come on now we doing a makeup tutorial sis don't drag me that's pretty okay so yeah so yeah like i was going to college and we was always like drinking and stuff like that and just having fun so it was one liquor store that never really um I, that never i need us i was gonna say never really but they really never i need us like so we always used to go to the same liquor store and um my thing is why when you put it on it, it don't ever come out the same on both eyes do y'all be dealing with that but so now I'm about to start using this angle type. I'm not angle, but just a little regular fluffy brush. And so, um, look how pretty that is from MYO Makeup. But yeah, so we used to go to the same liquor store because it was right directly across the street from the school or whatever. And so we, we was going there usually, like I don't know what party we was about to go to or... 
or what school event we was about to go to, but we was going out or whatever. And um, I was walking in there and we usually have to wait until people left because they go try to pretend like they was trying to ID us if somebody was in the store. And then it just made us have to send somebody else in. Honey, it was just a mess. So, we, um, yeah, that's what we used to do. And so, I was walking in because there was only one guy in the store. And he was like an older man or whatever. And, um, we saw that he had got whatever he was going to get. And then he was about to leave. So, I started to walk in so I can get what we was going to get. And then, we could leave, honey. So, <clears throat> The man comes, um, sees me walking in. So I'm going to take this Katsina or Katsina color in the Juvia's Place Saharan, Saharan palette. And I'm going to put it all over this round, like, dome shape brush to blend out, like, this blue or whatever. So we, I went in there. To see the guy, I mean, I see the guy walking by, and I still go in. Like, I really just, honey, it's still color on here from something else. I'm so, anyway, yeah. So, I see the guy or whatever, and, I mean, I just don't pay it no mind because, like, like I said, we came in there on a mission we be on a mission we don't be worried about no type of stuff like that like we was trying to get to what we needed to get so we can go so i'm actually finna use this to blend that out too but i feel like i don't have enough blue for the look that i'm going for the all over type of lid so i'm gonna put a little bit more and probably just blend it towards the top but yeah so i just saw him walking by spoke and went on about my business to go buy that car or whatever. So, um, when I'm coming out, of course, like, I kind of see that the guy didn't leave, but I really didn't care because, like, whatever. You know, it just wasn't my business, but it was something that I noticed. Like, okay, why are you still sitting in his car? So, I'm walking out, and he was like, do y'all be needing somebody to buy it for you? At this point, I'm like, is this a police officer, honey? Is you a motherfucking narc? I always wanted to use that word. <laughs> but for real, like, are you the police? Like, what's up? So I was like, what do you mean? I was like, no, we, you know, I can buy it or whatever. And he was like, well, is there anything else that you would need bought for you? Who? <laughs> like what? I said, no, I mean, we're good. He was like, I didn't say them, I said you. So I had this brush. It might be too big to use, <laughs> if I'm being completely honest. But it's my only brush that's completely, like, don't have no other color on it. You know? So it's going to work right now. But so he was like, no, I didn't say them, I meant you. I said... I said, what you talking about, sir? I called him sir to see if he was really a sir or if he was somebody grandpa trying to be a little, feel like a little young tenderoni again. Because if that was a case, honey, we could have just, come on now. You know how I am, y'all. You know, I just be trying to cut to the chase, okay? So, he was like, um, he was like, I didn't say, you know, them, I said you. And I said, stuff like what? And he's like, are you going to keep hollering across the parking lot or whatever? <laughs> Mind you, this was like a round man, like a very like older, just big. Like, I'm sorry. He wasn't like that, but he was just shaped like an older man. Like he was real tall. I don't know how to explain it. But he was real tall and he just looked like he was like 50 something. And he was like, you going to have me keep hollering around this parking lot? So I'm like, told my homegirls, I said, honey, you talking about buying stuff, so hold on. 
And so they was like, okay, you know, they ain't care, y'all. They was just happy. I had brought the bottle back. That's what they was doing. Occupy their time in the car, child. So I was like, you know, you know, what's up? That's all I said. Because, you know, like I said, I be right to the point with it, baby. What's up? Like, and he was like, well, I'm trying to see. I said, he was like, I'm trying to see what, what what can be, you know, what's going on. And I said, well, I'm not going, you know, I'm not going to somebody that'll be like sexually active with you or nothing like that. And he was like, okay, well, I appreciate you for being upfront, but that's not what I'm asking you to do. And I just said, honey, well, what is it then? What do you want me to do? <laughs> what's up? <laughs> like, what's up? So I'm just going to keep building it and blending it until I like what it looks like, basically. And I'm going to keep blending it with that same brown color. So, um, he was like, you know, that's not what I'm asking you of and everything. And I was like, well, can I, you know, I said my friend's ready to go, but like we can exchange numbers and we could just talk about it later, but we finna go somewhere. And he was like, oh, okay. So we did that. So... I had sent him a message, like a text, with my name. And he ain't really... So, I like the way this looks. I'm going to take the file out off, but I like the way it looks. And I also went to go get my dang coconut oil for my lips. I had, like, an um allergic reaction not too long ago. And on my lip. And um, a friend of mine told me that that happened with them too. With Bath and Body Works products, y'all. Said that the Bath and Body Works products broke out their lips or whatever. Because I had got that olive oil gel that be in the... um. That being Bath and Body Works, I don't know why I got it. I think it was like just on sale or something. And when I tell you, I woke up. Because I used it two nights because I couldn't find my coconut oil. So I used it twice. And I think the second time I used it before I went to bed, it did get on my lips. And, uh, you know how you be having kind of dry skin? Uh, that's not cute. But, um, I use it on my lips. And, honey, I woke up looking like herp a perp. Like, something was going on with me. Like, Dorian, Dorian talking about something. Who you been kissing on? Um, just rude in my time I need. Nah, but he helped me. He got me some stuff for my face. But I'm just going to put this on before I put the uh, foundation on. Yeah. Because, I don't know. I've just been really trying to, uh, really trying to protect my skin, y'all. Because that had me shook up, shook up, shook up. Ah. Period. Had me feeling some type of way. Like, what is this on my lips, honey? And I mean, it wasn't like no one bump. It was like messed up. My whole mouth was just bumpy. It was not cute. But anyway, so what part was I on? Oh, he, I had texted him my name or whatever. And, um, you know, we had was exchanging a little small conversation just because like, I just don't be giving stuff like that all my time because number one, I kind of feel like you are kind of weird. You probably like, well, why would you talk to him in the first place? But it's like, whatever. So anyway, I um gave him my number. I texted my name, and then um, from me texting him my name, he kind of was just like, okay, well. I'm just looking for somebody that would like to, you know, be fun and have fun and stuff like that. 
everything. And I was like, okay, cool. And he was like, you even can bring your friends. But the first time we hang out, I wanted to just be me and you. And I'll pay for, like, your books and stuff like that. So, my mind, I'm like, my books? So, y'all know I use this Dark Deepest and this Mineralized Skin Finish from MAC for my foundation powder. I don't use um, found, um liquid foundation anymore. And I'm going to use this flat brush, too. Girl, this my stuff, honey, okay? I love it. But, yeah, so... He was like, you know, I'll pay for your books for your schooling and everything. So I was like, I'm okay. Do you right, honey? Do you right? But he was like, yeah, the first time we hang out, I want us to just be by, you know, me and you. So we can kind of discuss everything. And then whatever. So I'm like, what is there really to discuss? So mind you, so many things that have happened in my life or that I've done. Like, I just really am so blessed because... Uh, me and my best friend done been to the Bahamas all in the car with the people. Just off the resort, all in the island. Just hanging out with the people. And nothing has ever happened to me. And I'm so thankful to God. And it's just crazy. But anyway. So, I told the, the man was like, <laughs> you know, he was going to pick me up from my dorm and everything like that. Let me take my hair scarf off. Mm -mm. You know she has a shortcut now. I be trying to maintain it at home, but girl, it's not a joke. It's not for the faint hearty, okay? To keep up with your shortcut. But anyway, so yeah, he was like, um... I'm going to pick you up. So I'm like, okay, cool. Or whatever from the dorm. So of course I, all my friends have his number. Like I told them his name, which could have been fake, but I still told my friends his name and everything. So I go, I'm in the car with him. And the first thing I noticed, that's going to be so funny to y'all. is like this man Wanted me to be so, like, impressed and happy every time he played the wobble. Like, the wobble, like, wobble, baby, wobble, baby, wobble, baby. Like that. Like, I noticed that he wanted me to, like, act lit when it came on because that was the only song, like, he played back to back. And I was just like, is he really wanting me to react to him playing the wobble though? Well, I'm like, well, like, I'm this finna be hard for me. Cause y'all know I'm full of shit. So I'm just sitting there waiting for him to look at me so I can be like, yeah, yeah, get in there. So I can act just the type as he want me to act. <clears throat> because I'm petty like that. So and I mean he was playing it out. Like, like, period. And this is just on our first encounter. Every time I saw this man, that's what he wanted to happen was the wobble to be on. So I had started hanging out with like my sweet mates and like other girls besides the girls from where I came from. And um, he was like, oh, I'm, I'm going too fast. I'm moving too fast. Okay. But I'm moving to fetch y'all. So, boom. We get to his house. And mind you, his house is like way outside from where the school is. So, I'm kind of like, ooh, where are you taking me? Like, what kind of man are you? What's up? Where are you taking me? So, he taking me or whatever to his, little, his house or whatever. And it's like in the country. Mind you, I didn't know that there was a country there. Like, I didn't know they had like an area... With like trees and like no no streets and all that, so I'm like, okay, dude, he must really not have no money. Like, why is he taking me here? And like, what's up? Like, he don't have must not have no big house because he's taking me to this country area. Little did I know, honey, he was showing me where the money was at down there because 
there was like the houses were so beautiful and like big and just pretty and just I was like whoa okay but his house was off like way in the back like it was way back there because his was like freshly paved like you can tell he just got his built and that was the Tarte Shape Tape uh, Concealer. And I think, let me see what color it is. Deep, of course. So it's in deep. Um, But yeah, so he took me out there and I was like, dang, like I didn't know that all that was back there. And it was a lot of beautiful houses back there and everything. So, fast forward, we get to his house. And he just opened up his little garage. What's in the garage when you pull the garage door up, okay? So, he opened his garage door, honey. Let's not talk about what's then. Let's talk about what's now. He had, like, four cars. Two was in the driveway and two was in the garage. And we was in one. So, I'm like, oh, you rich, rich. <laughs> oh, you got money, money, like. Okay, so I text my homegirl like, bitch, this boy, he got a coin coin. Like, he got money. So, we um get in his house. It's so nice. Like, everything is brand new in there. Everything. So, I'm like, what the heck? So, we just was talking. And then he was like, do you drink? <laughs> he was like, do you drink wine or just hard liquor? But in, in the inside, I want to say, honey, hard liquor, period. But I was like, no, nah, I will drink wine. So he opened up the wine and then he just kind of told me, like, he was like, I don't know. He was like, you guys just seem like a fun little bunch when I saw y'all in the in the liquor store. And um, I want to, you know, be a part of that. So in my mind, I'm like, what you mean? You know, like, what, be a part of, like, what? Like, you can't go nowhere with us. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? How you came from outside of the club? You can't even get in. Like you, you not finna go nowhere with us. So, okay. So y'all know I like an extra highlight. So I'm finna do um, warm sand again. Put it under my eye because you know I like a highlight. Really, what I need to do? Well, I'm gonna just finish the highlight because I should have did my eyeliner and stuff too. But um, yeah. So he was like, yeah, I um. Just want to be a part of that. So I'm like, still, like, what are you talking about? So basically, he was saying he want to be the person that buy our alcohol, have it stocked at his place, and then we basically just be over there drinking and talking and acting a fool over there. But he wanted us to do it at his place. So, I was like, what? Bet. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay. So, we had got a cracking. I'm like, get, 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 popping. We got a popping. Like, uh, my sweet mates, we was hanging out really tough. So, we just we used to be riding around already and, like, acting, doing already in the streets, just going places and talking and visiting and, you know, little kickbacks and all that. So, before we went, we just used to call him and be like, we finna come over there. And he used to just have all the alcohol and all, like, used to have us play music and stuff. But you know what he always would play, honey? Hey, big girl. And we used to be in there wobbling, boy. Because we wasn't working. <laughs> and we was just, really, it was like, I don't know. It wasn't weird because it seemed like he just wanted like company it shouldn't have been girls our age that he wanted company from but he never was weird like he really paid for my books twice like he just didn't really do anything to make me feel like uncomfortable or make us feel uncomfortable he was always cool he just was like shit when y'all finna turn up just come turn up over here that's really what i got from it so now I'm gonna use this L'Oreal Carbon Black Telescopic. 
liquid eyeliner and I'm gonna do a wing liner. I like doing wing liners when I have short hair, I don't know. But, and then I'm gonna finish my face, but I didn't even finish my eyes, put the lashes on or nothing. I just don't know why I went to put no foundation and stuff. But anyway, so yeah. He just wanted us to be hanging out over there. Yeah, I gotta be quiet when I do my eyeliner. And something else, y'all. I tried to get um like false lashes. It's, it's a no for me, though. I ripped them out. Like, it's still a few in here. But it's just like, it just wasn't my thing. Like, I don't know. I'm just not really that girl that's into, like, all that extra stuff. Extra maintenance. And I ain't want to sleep on my face because I flatten them and all that, like. Mm -mm. I don't got time for it. So, and then I feel like it didn't really. To me, I didn't really see like a big difference. At all. Like, you could tell it was there. But me looking at myself, I didn't really see a big difference. So for my wing, I go from the bottom of my eye. And I look down because that's how I like my wing to go. Mm. Then I'll just draw. I'm going to have to fix it. So I just draw up like what I want it to be. And then I drag it from my top. And make it meet, honey. And that's why I usually do it before I do my concealer. Because I'm going to have to fix that. Like, that's not cute. Because I don't like when people's wings be like, um. I don't like when people's wings be going up. But. Like I said, I'm going to have to fix it. Like, I don't know. Y'all not going to understand. But every time I try to do something like on camera, it be looking so dead. Like, look at that. <laughs> my wings, y'all follow me on stuff. Y'all know my wings don't be looking trashy like that. It's just like every time I be trying to do something on camera and tell y'all, it be looking so trashy, boy. So I'm finna just go ahead and get that off my face. I really feel like I should have used... um. I feel like I should have used my other liner. Because of this liner I found, when I did my gel liner with, I mean, yeah, when I did my wing with that liner, it was fire. Every time. But I'm finna see. Because it had, like, it was more of a brush. Does that make sense? Like, that was just like a hard, that is just like a hard thing that you pull across. And I had some gel liner that was a like a real was giving paint paintbrush tees. This don't. Let's see. This a whole different liner here.
See, that look better. But, um, it's just don't, this one is not, the consistency is not cute. It just don't get as black. Unless you got to keep trying to fill it in and fill it in and fill it in. And I really, the thing that's sad is I don't even know what happened to the one that I like. I just can't find it. Well, I'm going to let that dry and then I'm going to uh, go over it again with some concealer. But I like this one to go over like the um, shadows and stuff. Because it goes over it cute. Look at how red my eyes are. I'm so tired. But as far as just drawing the wing, it's just not working for me, bro. It's just not working for me. But maybe with my other hand, with my right hand, on this side, I, and maybe I'll be able to uh, do the wing cute, honey. Instead of it looking a mess. Girl, I don't even remember what part of the story I was on. But basically, yeah, he just wanted us to come and turn up with him before we went places. And that's what we used to do. We used to just go over there. And, um. See, this one is cuter. And I do feel like makeup is all about patience, to be honest. Because, like, I have to wait till this one dry, clean it up. After I was just trying to do this over and over again. And then when I clean this one up, like with this concealer, it's going to be cuter. And period. But it's just like. I like the black of this one. Like I just like how black it is. And how it goes on. Like the one I just used. It's like faded black. It's not super black. So I kind of used the concealer. To make like a stencil slick. So it could be giving giving y'all something. Giving you something you can feel. So girl. And clean. Cleaning it up a little bit on there. And this is something else I've been seeing a lot of people do. I'm going to use the blue that I used on my eyes for a liner. Or should I use black? I think I talked to y'all about this already. 
like me using liner me using um I'm not fixing that one because that's all you getting right now. It's late. It's late at night. It's not late at night. It's like 7. But anyway. So yeah. He just wanted us to kick up our shoes and relax our feet. With him. And um... And hang out with him, like, it was weird, like, because it was like, that's really, because you know how people are, like, they'll be like, oh, this is all I want, but genuinely, that's not, like, but he never once tried no slick stuff, like, I don't know, I just feel like, for me, people get that vibe. I feel that vibe is contagious. No, nah, but people feel that vibe for me. Like, I'm just finna be genuine with you. Like, I'm not finna be over here playing. If you say that's what you want, all right. Because, and don't be trying to be, get over on me because I don't be trying to get over on you. Like, I don't be trying to do no extra stuff. Y'all, should I use the blue under my eye? I'm gonna use it. And we're gonna see how we like it. But, um... Yeah, period. Don't don't try to get over on me, and I'm not gonna try to get over on you. Cause really, I can get over on people, but that's just not how I am. Like that's not my personality. But I feel like if you know me, then you know I can. Like you know, I'm like a good talker like I could talk you out of something period and don't mind talking you out of nothing cause it's that season for no reason how y'all feel about that the city girls album mm. I feel like Girl code is trash. Period is treasure. That's how I feel if you want to be honest. Girl code is not. Mm -mm. It's not giving me nothing. When period gave me. Boy I'm not a gang. I'm not a lame. I'm not your main thing. I don't want to be. Come on. Bags, I got several, and I just feel like I feel like JT going to jail is um that that could single handedly get rid of the city girls because I feel like JT is a personality of city girls. I feel like Carisha born, I feel like. Carisha can't rap. Carisha don't care about rap. JT actually care about rap. And JT be fucking sly. On them beats. And um. I don't know. I just feel like it wasn't good. And I feel like it wasn't good because. They were so worried about Curry. I mean JT going to jail. That's what I feel like. I feel like they didn't have the right shit on their mind to be trying to make no album. I feel like they were rushing to do it because, like I said, they knew JT was finna go to jail. And that's what I said. And I said what I said. Because y'all can act like... Girl code good, but I'm not gonna act like girl code good because girl code is not good. Mm -mm. It does nothing for me at all. None of the songs. I'm not even gonna be like the little twerk song with Cardi B. Girl, please. Could have kept it. Um. Really, just every song was not good. <laughs> like I really don't know what else to say. I didn't like anything. And I know, like, it don't matter that I didn't like it. But 
I'm just saying that to y'all because, you know, y'all are here. And I'm going to tell y'all. But, yeah, it was not good at all. I didn't like it. But I see people saying stuff about it and everything. Like, trying to say that it's good. Because it's been going on Twitter. Like, everybody been mocking them. And everything. So. Like, the City Boys thing. I think that's so lame. Because all male rappers do is flex and lie about stuff that they got when they know there's not nothing that they have or that they gonna have. So, I just feel like. Why city girls can't rap about what they rap about? To be honest. Girl. To be honest, you cute. But you a stranger. You should hit me up more. Basically. Did y'all used to do them? And if y'all lie and say y'all didn't unsubscribe. Because y'all know y'all used to be giving those um to be honest out. And they all used to say the same thing. Girl. My last night, I'm right, but who finna succeed? Who finna now carry on? <laughs> and a part of me feels like this not even the same lash. Like, I feel like these lashes don't match. But a part of me does feel like um, that this lash that I put on is not cute. And it's like plastic. Where I even get this from? Why do I have this in my thing? Why did I buy that? Mm -hmm. Yep, these is not the tea. I just want to know why do I have it? I think it is the same. It is. It's the same, honey. But yeah, so I really think that that album is fresh. And I think that that old man just wanted a friend. And I was there just like fucking Toy Story. You got a friend in me. Period. So... I'm still not even done with my makeup, which is crazy to me because y'all know my makeup do not be taking me, no, 43 minutes. And I really don't even want to make this video no 43 minute long video. But who bald headed ass always be talking about? Oh, this video is so short. This video is so short. Y'all. So y'all bald headed ass better sit here and watch all this video. And the only reason how I'm going to know if y'all watch this video is because if y'all say something about me calling y'all bald headed. Because nobody wants to be fucking called bald headed. And all y'all bald headed. So. I'm gonna know if y'all watched it or not. If y'all say something about me calling y'all bald headed. And if y'all didn't. I don't even want y'all to even come. Don't swing my way. With the complaints about. The length of the video because. Here I am making a head ass long video for y'all. <laughs> and if y'all don't watch it, I'm not doing it no more. Yeah, I'm not doing it no more. I'm sorry. Can y'all tell me now? Because I'm acting a little bit. I'm doing a little bit too much. I'm leaving messages and voicemails telling you I miss you. Baby, am I doing too much? Tell me what's the issue? Who I get these lips to? Baby, am I doing too much? This is turning into something I ain't hip to. Baby, am I doing too much? 
Staying right here by the phone for you to call me. Hear your voice tone. So I'm right here, Pana. I'm wrong for using this brush with it. <laughs> Y'all come get me. Cause I'm just showing you. <sighs> come get me. And she's done with her face, period, point blank. Yes. This was so fun, trying something new, a different color, a new cut, a new color, a new hairdo on here. Mystic, that's what I'm gonna call this look. Mystic, period. This was fun. You know, I always love you guys. And you know, I will always be back to talk to y'all. And look at what my man got me. Period. 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 Yes, I love you guys. This was so fun. And I'll be back.